week's tip of the week where we will be discussing the lock checks printing feature under the house bank accounts. Sometimes users uh, get kicked out of SAP while in the middle of a check run, and when they try to log back into SAP and try to print their checks, they're unable to select the checks under the print checks for payment because the checkbox is grayed out. Uh, this can occur when multiple users are trying to print checks at one time. The solution for this, um, when it occurs, open up the house bank account setup window, scroll all the way to the right and check to see if the lock checks printing checkbox is selected. If it is checked, then uncheck it and return back to the document printing for checks for payment and you should be able to now select the checks that you would like to print. We are going to go into a demo in SAP. So if you go under banking and open up the document printing for you'll select checks for payment and fill out the selection criteria that you want for your checks. And if you select OK, you'll be able to see these check boxes where you can select and print your checks from. If these two or however many boxes are grayed out and you are unable to uh, select print, then it is always a good option to under admin set up banking and to check the house bank accounts. So as you can see, there's a few house bank accounts. If you scroll all the way to the right, um, you'll see the lock checks printing feature. Um, as you can see, it is grayed out. Um, you are actually unable to manually select this. It only automatically selects when you do get booted from SAP, um, which is a good thing. But if these are selected, you'll want to uncheck them and then select update. Um, and if you go back to checks for payment, you should now be able to select these just like this and then uh, continue printing. So um, this does, um, although it can be frustrating, this checkbox has its benefits. Uh, like I previously mentioned, if multiple users are trying to print at once, it will kick you out of SAP to prevent incorrect or inaccurate check numbers within the system, which acts as a fail safe to just to um, be preventative of issues in the future. And being aware of this checkbox um, can just save you a lot of time when troubleshooting, and it is a relatively simple fix. Uh, I hope that this quick tip was helpful and that will be utilized to its full potential in the future. Thank you for listening.